think he's gorgeous. To have this venue is exquisite. Not only is there good art here, but it's just the atmosphere here. I love how they utilize the whole museum itself. So you get a chance to be outside, you get a chance to be inside. I just think it's a really great example of community. You walk around and you see so many different kinds of people enjoying the city together. It really showcases Milwaukee well. We do like to go to the festivals in the Midwest and Wisconsin, and, and this is one of the stars of, of the season, certainly. The food is great, the atmosphere great. It's just lovely to be here, too. We've really enjoyed the art of this festival. We enjoyed sitting out on the deck and you know the view of the lake. It's been a really nice day out here. Milwaukee's a really generous town and art-loving town, and the show consistently is a uh, one of the best shows in the country. No matter what, it's in top five, and for me, it's one of the top two. The quality of this show is phenomenal. I do about 12 outdoor shows, real high-end shows throughout the country, and this is one of the prettiest and most well-organized and high-quality art. And so that's it in a nutshell. The volunteers at the museum are just incredible. They're a wonderful group of women that just do anything they can for you. The people that run it are so friendly. They, they're open-minded. They're uh, progressive as far as they're always trying to make it better. They do everything they can for the artists to help us, which is great. You can go to great shows, even shows that have great reputations, and you can go from booth to booth, and there's always wondering, like, what, how did these people get here? But this show, everybody belongs here. The quality of art here is, is second to none. It's spectacular. The jury uh, did a wonderful job in, in choosing the art that's here. Are you having fun today? Yeah. <laughs> What's been your favorite thing? Painting. It's easy for him to just walk up and try an activity. And, uh, you know, it's not too complicated. You know, simple is good, but they get the idea of creating art. It's been a lot of fun. They have more and more for the kids every year. That's, I think they have a lot of fun. They even had a play that they were doing out there. Don't stand there laughing. Aren't you going to help me down? Well, I think it's a perfect match, honestly, between community and company because at PNC Bank we have a long-term commitment to early childhood education and we try to do our fair share as it relates to investing in the children in our community and so what a better way than to come here, showcase what we have and to be involved in this children's experience. It's been wonderful, frankly. I mean, the types of conversations we're able to have, the families we're able to engage with here, talk about our company, our story, and our firm belief in this community. It's just been amazing. The children are having a ball. They're planting flowers. Again, it goes back to we sit on this natural resource. It's a great way also to have a green aspect to what we're doing. Uh, so people are really enjoying it. We are as well. One of the things that I'd heard in the past is that there's this temporary fence that goes up for like Front Festival of the Arts. And logistically, you need that. But it wasn't the most inviting. And so my idea was to really bring the art out of the tents and write out um, greeting people as they come in, hopefully to invite them. You can just walk by. We've had people rollerblade or drive their bikes by. And so everybody can enjoy it. Being able to have an opportunity as a sponsor has just allowed us to have a bigger presence and really show that we're part of the community and that we support the arts, we support the art museum, and we support Milwaukee.